Yeah, Larry and Kristen, emotions were certainly running high out there today with protests outside San Francisco City Hall and the Israeli consulate and people on both sides of this conflict desperately calling for peace. Bring them home! Bring them home! A call from protesters outside San Francisco City Hall. More than a dozen Bay Area Jewish community groups gathering demanding the safe release of roughly 150 people taken hostage by Hamas. We need to bring them home safe. The negotiations has to start. Someone has to do something to bring them home. Neri Life Choma is one of the organizers of Friday's protest. Some of the families don't even know whether their loved ones are hostages or killed because they just have no word. It's so hard to be away from home uh, in these terrible days. Uh, we feel helpless. Uh, we want to hug our friends and families, and it's just physically impossible. I didn't think there was anything more important than to be here today to stand with the hostages from this absolutely barbaric act of terrorism in southern Israel. Our hearts are just breaking. And police presence strong outside City Hall with mounting concern over possible retaliation. We are encouraging people to be cautious and add security measures but we cannot cower in fear. We need more voices from our community and our allies today more than ever. There are people who didn't come purely out of fear, and they would have come otherwise. People with kids, people, yeah, they just didn't come. The depravity is unimaginable. There was no choice. I had to come to show my support to bring the hostages back. Free, free Palestine. Meanwhile, outside the Israeli consulate, a small group gathering in support of the people of Palestine. They are not having uh, humanity for uh, from Israel. Israel is getting advantage today. They punish them for 75 years, and now it's time to stand up and say it's enough. There had to be peace over there. There had to be resolution that they had to do over there, but we cannot support the continuing of the killing of the people. Now, as for what is coming next, event organizers at both of these protests told me there are plans for more to come. As for those details, they say they're taking it day by day. And, of course, we will fill you in on all of that as we learn more. Larry and Kristen. All right.